Success and failures are part of our lives, but to become successful, one must take that extra leap forward. I have with me the CEO of 3CS, an award-winning web design company in Sri Lanka, Sandarwan Madhum Bandara. Welcome to the show, Mr. Sandarwan. Let's directly move into the question. What is the secret to success? There is no secret formula to our success. Um, over the past 18 years, uh, we have evolved. Uh, we didn't start off as a web design company. Uh, we did a lot of uh, different services and then we identified what we were good at and focused on those areas. Um, so I would say we've done a lot of small incremental changes and over time that tends to add up uh, to a much higher quality product. Uh, and that's what we focused on. We haven't really focused on marketing ourselves, uh, but we have focused on uh, really the quality of our product. Uh, and uh, our customers have come to recognize this. So most of our business comes from referral and from people looking at our portfolio and then contacting us. Um, so we provide a very personalized service uh, and I'm very really passionate about what we do. So I think uh, that has, that's been what has fueled us our success. On your path to success, you must have faced various challenges. How did you overcome them? Uh, well, I would say I have failed at most of the things I have tried to do. Uh, and the success is maybe only 5% of everything I have tried. Um, we treat failure as an opportunity to learn. So we are constantly looking at uh, the changing marketplace, changing competition, uh, changing technologies. Uh, we are very flexible in how we deal with people as well as in our processes. So every day we go to work uh, and try to learn something new. Um, of course you have to manage and control failure so that you don't disrupt your processes uh, and you don't disrupt the businesses of your clients. We like to fail in private uh, but only make our successes public. Web design is a very competitive field. What is the message you would give the upcoming entrepreneurs? Well, don't chase the money. Uh, I know people start businesses to make money. But what my advice to young entrepreneurs would be, find something you love doing, uh, be passionate about it, do it with a lot of commitment, uh, and people will recognize this, they will respond to it, and the success will follow. Briefly, how would you define success? I would say in, in the product, I mean, if you look at us, uh, we are digital artists, we like to treat ourselves as digital artists, uh, so our product is art, and if the product is the highest quality product, that you can deliver, uh, that is success.